Hi, so I'm here to talk about RingDroid. RingDroid is a Android app that lets you edit your own ringtones from existing music on your SD card. So I'm going to demo it right now. Now you'll see that when RingDroid starts up, you see a list of the available music that you have. And I am now going to edit one of my songs and make it into my ringtone. Notice how RingDroid starts up with a waveform, and with this waveform, you can actually see what you're editing and you can move it around. So I'm going to drag it around and show you how this works. And now after I've uh, dragged it around, I can play a preview to see if this is actually what I wanted to hear for my ringtone. If I ha feel happy about it, I can go ahead and save it. And I can set it as my default ringtone. Even better than that, RingDroid is also great for developers because with a very simple intent call, developers can use RingDroid inside their own application. So I'm going to show a quick, very quick demo of that, which is, uh, which is uh, there is an app called uh, Soundboard. There, there is an app called uh, Soundboard, which lets you use, which lets you create your own uh, goofy soundboard uh, with goofy sounds, and it lets the user set their own thing. So I'm going to start that. Now, the idea behind Soundboard is that the user can create their own icons, create their own sounds, and do whatever they want. And they edit their sounds by using RingDroid. So I'm going to uh, create a button here with the RingDroid sound. And now if I try to pick a sound clip, here I'm taping. And so now if I try to uh, take a sound clip here, it's going to use RingDroid. So uh, I just click the Run RingDroid button. And notice how I've now started RingDroid from this other application. And so now I can cut this piece of music out. And voila, now I've made a sound button that uses the piece of music I've selected. And there you go. So this is how you can use RingDroid in another application. Uh, thank you for watching and search for RingDroid on Android Market. It's free and open source, so go out there and grab it. See ya.